My name is Justin Daniel. I am studying agriculture leadership and I'm currently a sophomore and I am nominating Dr. Boren for professing excellence. I wanted to submit a nomination for Dr. Boren because she went above and beyond over the summer in order for us to attend our study abroad trip. Uh, she, we were supposed to go to Nicaragua, but they decided to have a revolution before we were supposed to leave and uh, the university was gonna cancel our entire trip, but Dr. Bourne fought for us to go to Costa Rica for two weeks instead. Dr. Bourne embodies the values and spirit of Texas Tech through applying the classwork we do to the working world and going out of her way to make sure every student has what they need to get the proper education and their degree. If I could tell Dr. Bourne one thing, I'd tell her to keep going above and beyond and making sure her students have everything they need to be successful in, her li in their life because She's done that for me. My name is Olivia Samborn. I'm a freshman music education major, and I nominated Professor Sarai Brinker for the Professing Excellence Award. I wanted to submit um, Professor Brinker for this award because I feel like she was always going above and beyond and making sure that we were taken care of and that we knew our content. She would give us tons of extra materials outside of class. Her door was always open if we needed to talk to her and um, just the level of attentiveness that she gave to all her students in that class was really cool. What was really cool, she hosted these events where like um, music students, you don't even really have to be in her class, but people in the School of Music could come to her house um, after school and we'd have an event where we all just sing, play music together, and perform. I thought that was um, really cool and a great way to bond with her and other people in the department. I would say just thank you for making me feel so welcome in my first semester and for having such an interesting class. It made me really excited to learn about musicology, music history, um, and just always going above and beyond. I'm Grant Tikal. I'm studying mechanical engineering. Um, I'm a sophomore here at Tech and I nominated Zach Cardenas for the Professing Excellent Award. Uh, walking into lab, Zach, uh, he, was, he was just walking around talking with everybody. Um, and just getting to know them like on a personal level, just talking about, I don't know, how their weeks go and or like what sports they like or whatever. And uh, I forgot exactly what he said to me, but I remember he made me feel like I was genuinely cared for. To, to teach well, you have to understand it well. And uh, he, he teaches and makes things clear like so greatly. Um, like me and my fellow classmates in lab would bring problems to him that we were confused on or didn't quite understand and he would just explain it like so clearly and just, I was like, wow, that makes sense, thank you. If I could tell Zach anything right now, uh, I'd tell him thank you and that he's awesome, you know, and I appreciate him a lot um, and that people around him do see and they do notice the extra work that he puts in and uh, they do notice the, like his genuine care um, and how he makes people feel welcomed and encourages them. My name is Samantha Keltner, and I am currently studying a Bachelor's of Science in Mathematics with a minor in Economics. I am also a senior, graduating in December of 2019. I nominated Professor Lars Christensen for Professing Excellence. I nominated Professor Lars because he is actually a really patient person. I don't know many professors that would be okay with someone taking their class twice or taking them twice. I mean, he had a lot of patience with me. He was always in his office. He always had something for his class to better learn the stuff. He's just overall a good person, and I don't know if he notices when people are going through a bad time, but like, I was having so much trouble. I just wanted to leave the class, and that's actually one of the days that he like made us all like turn around and talk to everybody, and I was like, oh man, don't do this to me. But like, it, just his smile and the way he acts towards his classes, like, like he's like a friend, you know? Yes, he is a professor, he's a doctor in mathematics, and, but he treats us like friends. He doesn't treat us like his students like we're below him, you know? And because of that reason, you know, he like, I, I wanna thank him because that was a really tough time for me and he was just there without even knowing that he was there for me, so. My name is Arif Ahmed. I'm a senior at Tech State University. Currently I'm studying petroleum engineering and this is my last semester. And I have nominated Mr. Al Giosani for professing excellence. What sets Mr. Giosani apart would be like, you know, how he has helped me throughout my college uh, career. So whenever I had a problem or advice, I need advice for my college, 
he I would go to him and then he would literally like sit with me for hours and tell me what classes I should take uh, how should I look for a job or internships and how uh, should I like approach petroleum engineering as a whole he takes time it's not like you know he takes a student for 10 minutes and asks them to leave rather he's there for the entire day and he never asks us hey I have to go somewhere like his interest is this uh, like you know is the students if I had to say uh, one thing to Mr. Giosani it would be, Mr. Giosani, I'm honored to have you as my professor. Uh, no doubt you're one of my best professors of all time. And uh, like, no, I really thank you for everything you have done for me and for the department on behalf of all the students at the petroleum department. Uh, thank you, sir, for your hard work. And we really appreciate everything, uh, like, no, all your commitment. So thank you very much, sir. My name is Georgia Wetnell, and I am currently a sophomore at Texas Tech studying business management and I nominated Melissa Hancock for Professing Excellence. One of the reasons why I wanted to submit this professor is because she always goes above and beyond. I mean, for instance, in one of our classes, Melissa also happens to work in pharmaceuticals and she got her supervisor to come down and give us a presentation on interviewing, which is super cool because it's like a real life experience of people you know, how people would go through an interviewing process with like the person who would be hiring you. Melissa, like she just loves TTU. So I thought that was really cool because it was awesome seeing her professor that was like from tech, loves tech, stayed at tech my freshman year because it kind of like set the standard. Another quality that I believe sets them apart is their humor. I mean, you always joked about, you know, our class not finding you funny, but I was laughing the whole time. I mean, I appreciate all the jokes, all the effort and thought into what you're saying and how it ties into our lectures was really cool and really creative and funny. So don't forget that you're always a funny person. Hey, I'm Ashley. I am a senior here at Texas Tech and I nominated Dr. Machado for professing excellence. I wanted to submit a nomination because not only is she passionate about what she does and what she teaches, she's also very understanding of the students and kind of sees you more of a person than just another student in the classroom. Well, there's actually quite a few times that she went above and beyond, but one that stands out to me is I was extremely sick last semester and I had to go to the hospital and instead of just saying, okay, well, you can make up this test or quiz, she asked how I was doing and if I even had any family there with me. She wanted to know more about what was going on and how I was feeling. If I could tell her one thing right now, I would tell her that even though it's her first year, She's already made a great impact and that she's just a really good professor. I'm Cassandra Cisneros. I'm a freshman here at Texas Tech. I'm studying electrical engineering and I nominated Dr. Seroff for professing excellence. I wanted to submit a nomination for Dr. Seroff because in his class, after I took my first final, that was the time I received my first B. So I walked into his office hours feeling like a failure. And then I walked out and he, he really encouraged me and he took the time out of his schedule to tell me a story about a student who only received one B in his life and to use that as a reminder that B's aren't failures, they're just a reminder of how hard it is to receive an A. So I walked out feeling much more reassured of myself and encouraged for the next semester. Dr. Seroff demonstrates the overall values of Texas Tech University because he held our class to a very high standard. We make sure the students know that he's always willing to help whether you're his current student or taking another class. If I could tell Dr. Seroff one thing, it'd be to thank him for motivating me to continue pursuing electrical engineering and that I hope to continue working with him throughout my undergrad. My name is David Lucero. I am a journalism major and a graduating senior, and I nominated Justin Weaver for the Professing Excellence Award. Senior year comes around and I have a little, a slightly tougher project where I need to interview someone in a job I kind of want and also go to their workplace and take B-roll and a lot of things. And he just said yes instantaneously, <laughs> like without hesitation. And I found that was amazing. Like he's so helpful in all these different ways. And that's just for me. I don't even know what he does for other people. <laughs> so I think he embodies like the spirit of Texas Tech perfectly, just helpful in every single way. <laughs> what set Justin Weaver apart was that he avidly was like, he was adamant on giving me just resources, like resources, so many. <laughs> um, I remember the second time I met with him, he was like, yeah, do you ever, if you ever want like information on like possible internships, maybe jobs, or other 
things in the like National Weather Service or weather related um, jobs like I'm your man just come to me shoot me an email anything <laughs> if I could tell Justin Weaver anything I would say keep helping others as much as you helped me because again I don't know what you do with other students but I hope you give your time to them as much as you did to me I'm Ryan Clark I'm a senior electrical engineer and I nominated Dr. Elisa Wong for the Professing Excellence Award. I remember one time Elisa brought in a print uh, for lunch during class and that was one of the most interesting things. It's the first time and only time I've ever met a prince. And we just all sat down. I think we either ate pizza or lasagna with him. And he just kind of talked about the EU and how Brexit was affecting everything. And that was amazing. She took me studying abroad in Italy where there I had to kind of learn to speak Italian to Italians and that's something I'm not comfortable with necessarily with English to people who speak English so uh, she really helped me through that and then she helped me pursue leadership opportunities uh, and just kind of pushed me to the best person I could be I just tell Lisa thank you it's been a great four years here at Texas Tech and I plan on living a lot more great years and I think it's there's a root there, and one of those roots is definitely Eliza Wong.